Hey, uh, thanks for uh, clicking, watching this, real, what I'm calling a real world review, because there are a lot of reviews out there that uh, talk about build quality and you know keyboards and stuff like that. What I want to focus on is how I've been using this uh, Samsung uh, Chromebook Pro in my everyday uh, work. And the way I ended up with this, uh, I, I've been wanting one of these since before they came out last year. Uh, but I felt that a little bit on the expensive side, uh, I didn't know how I'd like the different aspect ratio. I didn't know if I would use the stylus. Uh, and the Asus uh, C302 Flip uh, was getting great reviews, especially for the keyboard. Uh, the keyboard here they said wasn't as good as the flips and the keyboard is important to me because I can type fairly fairly fast uh, and so I actually purchased the flip uh, I purchased it through Amazon warehouse deals and uh, I, I it came in I got it and I started setting it up used it as a tablet for maybe uh, 10 or 15 minutes before letting it you know charge up all the way and then later that evening, I pulled it out to answer an email and discovered that the keyboard was, uh, for lack of a better term, wonky. Uh, it was messed up. Uh, the space bar would, would get stuck. Uh, and uh, every time I would type a B, it would stick a space in, even though I wasn't hitting the space bar. Uh, this, it would put spaces in in weird places. And after spending about uh, five to six minutes trying to do a three sentence email, I said, there's no way I can ever get used to this. It's just, it's messed up. So I'd have to send it back to Amazon. Well, I was disappointed, but it gave me the opportunity to at least use the keyboard a little bit. And so I knew what the keyboard was like. And I thought, you know, I noticed that, that Best Buy had a 64 gig version of the Pro. And I thought I might as well give it a chance. I'll, I'll go to our, my local Best Buy, see if they have one on display, which they did. Uh, they had the Plus, which is basically the same hardware and everything. And I thought, I'm, I'm, just, going, I'm just going to try it out. And as I was there, I thought, you know, Best Buy has a 14 day return policy. You know, I think I'll go ahead and get this before I, uh, you know, order another flip from Amazon. I, th I think I'll get this. I'll take it home. I have 14 days, I'll just, I'll use it and see about the aspect ratio. I'll see about the, uh, you know, using this as, as a notebook, notepad. And I have to tell you, uh, after two days, I, I was sold. I thought there's no way I am taking this back. And so I just wanted to do uh, this hopefully short review, sharing with you uh, why I like this so much uh, because some of you might feel the same way I do, that you're not sure about the keyboard, you're not sure about the aspect ratio, which uh, does, doesn't bother me at all. And I'm going to take this and I'm going to log in here. Oh, there we go. Uh, and, and here it is. I mean, it's a Chromebook. So if you're familiar with Chromebooks, uh, you know, you, you kind of know how it works. I got the one with the Intel because uh, Intel processor because I I do run Linux and so uh, Linux runs very nicely on this one with the M3 chip. But what was a game changer and what was so surprising for me is using this thing as a notebook uh, or a notepad. Whoops, I just turned the thing off. Oh, there we go. So I'm going to log back in. I meant to do the stylus and for whatever reason I hit the, the on and off switch instead. So every time you pull the stylus out, it, it gives you a, a menu and uh, you know you can change, you know, it says create note, you can change what that is. For me, I've been using squid. And so here's an untitled note. And as you, uh, let, let me see if I can do this so uh, you can see. The writing it, it's it, it's like writing on the actually it's better at least for me uh, than writing on paper because it is very smooth my writing is atrocious uh, so this actually works better than when I do a notepad or in my notebook I wasn't sure about the stylus because it's it's kind of small and thin but it hasn't bothered me at all uh, you know I'll go back 
and you can see I've been going to town. I, I've got some, uh, some journal entries that I've been doing. I have uh, uh, meeting notes. And the cool thing is this up here was from an email uh, that I wanted to bring up during our meeting. And one of the things that I just love, and I'll show you on this website, and you can do this from any website, you can do it from your email, you can do it from anywhere. Uh, I just tell it to capture a region. And, you know, I, I can do the text and it says copy to clipboard. And then if I go back to Squid or really wherever, I'll go to this uh, thing here, uh, I can uh, paste that puppy in and it's right there. Uh, it works even with uh, the, the pictures. So copy that to clipboard. Uh, go back to... Uh, I was just looking at the article. It's so sad about the, you know, the, the violence going on and the, the shootings. Uh, so, but I can, uh, you know, put that in there and then I can uh, make my, my notes. Uh, I, I can, uh, you know, circle, I can annotate, I can do whatever. And, and that's even true of... Uh, and, and this, I, I really like this. Uh, I'll, I'll go and I'll pull an Amazon Kindle because I do uh, quite a bit of reading. And, uh, I, I, you know, you can highlight and everything, uh, but if you really want to, um, you know, get it into your notes, uh, you can do that as well. And you're probably getting a sense of, of where all this is going. Um, so I, I paste that in and then, you know, here we go. There it is again. I mean, uh, uh, there, there, were, there was something else I had thought about as I was doing that and now I, 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 I can't remember. Uh, but, you know, you, you get the, oh, I remember what it was. Uh, with Squid, you can even import a, uh, and I'm, I'm looking for it here, uh, a PDF. Oh, here we go. And this is a PDF of a book. And, you know, you, you can copy, uh, or not copy, but highlight. Uh, so there's a highlighter there, which you can highlight. And, and what I really like is the ability, and I should have probably mentioned this before, to erase by just using your finger. You know, so if I go back to my note and I, and I make a note here, uh, and I don't like that, I can just use my finger uh, and I love it because I don't have to go back here and choose a menu or anything. So that's, I think that's the highlight. Uh, again, it, it's, it, the, build, the build feels good, but you know, you can go to a lot of review or a place sites and uh, you know, they'll talk about the build. Uh, you know, they'll talk about the keyboard, they'll talk about the screen. I really wasn't wanting to do that. You can get that other places. I, I just want you to get a sense of at least for me, uh, this has been a game changer. Uh, I do presentations. I'm, I'm a pastor. I do sermons every week. I, I do research. I can pull quotes from my different programs that I'm using on the tablet. Uh, Android apps work very well. I use OneNote quite a bit. I also use Evernote and, uh, and, and Google Keep once in a while. And I can just pull sections of texts out of my online books or out of websites or out of articles and just paste it in and I can circle it and I can put notes, which I'm finding works better for me than uh, actually, you know, trying to, to copy and paste it into a, a document and then write my notes underneath. I don't know why, uh, because I, I type probably quicker than what I write, but there's just something about writing and being able to circle and point and put arrows uh, that has just really uh, been a game changer for me. So give it a shot. Uh, if you're kind of on the fence and you don't know, uh, I, you know I, I was surprised. I really was. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me through email or, or some other means, and uh, I'll be willing to answer any questions that I can. All right, well, thank you for watching.